Keaton just looking back at the tape. How do you feel coming out of that Arizona game? Um, you know, did a lot of good things as a whole offensively, but also uh, for me personally, a few few things uh, that um, could have done better, but I think that's where you learn from it. You know, it's got to be more consistent coming, coming forward. Keenan looked just as fast on tape yes, as he did. Very really. fast. And, you know, the offensive line man, that's a big hole for him, so made it easy for him, too. What's the reaction in the film that you guys watch about those two runs by him? They're pretty excited. How's the team just handle all these injuries, everyone staying in good spirits? Yeah, you know, you got to. Um, you know, um, I mean, again, as I said last, I think on Saturday, from the beginning with JT going down, you know, your starting quarterback gets hurt. Um, you never had, like to see that. Then to have, you know, your first three running backs go down, you know, again, you're, you never want to see that happen. But, you know, you got to move up. You got to have that next man up mentality. What are maybe, like, two things that you want to do better in your game? Uh, be more consistent. Um, I think that's the main thing. And then with that, staying disciplined. Consistent how? Um, you know, Again, I think there was a spurt, few spurts in the game where I made a lot, made a few mistakes in a row, and uh, then I'd come back the next drive and make a few, few good, the right read, you know. Uh, so I think just making the right read all the time um, needs to be, or at least if I make a mistake, you know, coming back the next play and, and correcting it, you know, not letting it turn into two or three. If you get like when you do one, does it kind of bug you? Is that what happens there, maybe? Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm. Saying. I need to forget that last play and just keep playing. When it comes to making the right read, does that just come with more experience, or is there something you can do specifically in practice to help you get better at that? Uh, yeah, probably more experience. And I mean, as Coach said, you know, you're only going to get better with reps. So I think that comes a lot with practice. And you know, um, I want to make an excuse for myself, but you know, it is only my third game. So I think part of that is like what you said, what, and Coach kind of told me that is um, mostly when I was the backup, you're only going to get better with, with, with reps in practice. You got to attack it as good as you can. And uh, yeah, that's, that's the only way I can get better. And that's how do you feel like you progressed from your first start to now? Yeah, and that's what, that's I feel like a lot better than I did, you know, when I first started playing here from the Stanford game even. So, um, you know, getting the reps in practice and again as the as the one you get a lot more. Professor Saw this was great in the film this last game. What grade would you give Uh average, C, maybe below average, D. I don't know. What were some of the things you saw that you um, just a few plays I should have made, and then uh, you know a few things I forced in there that I probably shouldn't. Have. What are some things you take away from the two road starts already? Uh, I'll bring it up. You know, hit the road again. Uh, yeah, you know, I just gotta play play. We know the, the way we know we can. You know, um, I don't know if it really matters that much being on the road. I guess you're right. We have one on the road, but you know, you can see we can play well on the road. If we did in Notre Dame, um, we just had to put a complete game together. Thank you. That's it. Yep.